Welcome to this tutorial. In our short video you will get familiar with the most important features of the Direwolf modeler for collaboratively creating and editing iStar models. The iStar modeling language is a conceptual modeling language focusing on intentional, social and strategic dimensions. It allows to visualize complex relationships among systems and stakeholders to help understanding their needs. The Direwolf modeler supports you to create models without having to install an app. It runs directly within your browser. Furthermore, you can invite your team members to join you in the editing. You will then see their edits in near real time. To start a new model, point your browser to direwolf.rocks slash spaces slash, then enter an arbitrary string which is your model name and share the resulting URL with your team members. In each so-called space, you can create one iStar model. Currently, no authentication system is in place, so for the time being, choose your space name wisely. On the left, you see the scrollable palette with model elements. To add a node on your canvas, simply drag and drop it from there. In this example, we will create a simple model for travel agency scenario. For instance, Let's create an actor with the role student and a general actor as travel agency. You can move elements around by selecting them and then drag and dropping them. To rename an element, first select it and then change its name in the properties view on the right. Names can span multiple lines. To delete an item, simply use the backspace or delete key. You can also group items. Let's create an actor boundary around a student by first creating the boundary and then moving the student inside. To model a simple dependency, let's create a task inside the student boundary. In this example, the student's task is to buy a flight ticket through the agency. To do that, the student depends on the travel agency. To connect two elements, make sure they are not selected. Then drag an edge from the source node to the target. Finally, select the appropriate edge type from the palette. Once your iStar model is ready, there are multiple ways to save it locally. With the first icon in the top bar, you can export a JSON file describing the model. To open it later, use the second button. Currently, the canvas has to be empty for that. The third icon exports an SVG file that you can open with any software capable of vector graphics. Direwolf Modeler is under active development. Therefore, Currently, there are no awareness features to see what your team members are working on. If you miss any additional features, feel free to enter them in Requirements Bazaar. Thank you for watching.